Hello. Good evening. It's been a while since I've done any sort of individual level run of any Hitman game, and I just felt like doing one. And I chose the author because I don't think I've ever really done anything interesting in the author, and I want to see what I can think of. So we got this sniper thing. Okay, so these first two shots are to distract Brother Akram's personal bodyguards to run in my direction immediately. The th third shot is the doorbell, so Akram comes to the balcony. The fourth shot is uh, to make uh, Craig Black panic in the church and flee to his shed. And the fifth shot is probably unnecessary to distract one dude uh, outside to just not go into the building. And that shot was uh, obviously just to make uh, Brother Akram panic and run, now that his bodyguards have already abandoned him. Okay, and there's Craig Black and his highly observant bodyguard. I really like this guy. Don't ask me how this works. It just does sometimes. And there's Akram, perfect, running behind his bodyguards so they don't see a thing. Yeah, it's, uh, I honestly wouldn't call this a good route, because uh, the Craig Black kill especially is pretty random. Typically, uh, if his body isn't found instantly, it's never gonna be found, but more often than not, it is found instantly. It's not unreasonable, but it's not what I would call consistent, therefore I'm not a fan of it. And uh, after that point, the, the most uh, difficult thing is actually just to make sure that uh, Brother Agram's body is not found, which is why I left the gold bar behind there, and just hope that the guard who is nearby goes for the gold bar rather than for the body. But yeah, that's a fun little sniper route that I probably would recommend, but was an interesting one. Hope you enjoyed it, and thanks for watching, and so on and so on.